keeper. Morgan continues pursuit and it's rocketed out of bounds. And when you're that dogged in pursuit, you will force the defense and the goalkeeper into some tricky situations. And if you if you haven't read the article in the Rochester Democratic Chronicle by Jeff DeVeronica today, it was a it was a great article on Alex Morgan and uh, what she does on and off the field. Just very very nice article by Jeff DeVeronica. Ellie Riley sends one off. Edwards on the end heads it into the back of the net. Becky Edwards connects with the Kiwi Ellie Riley, and it's two nil Western New York. Alright, so just settling into the 18 and allowing Becky Edwards, so we're, we're saying let's get the midfield into the attack a little bit more. And Allie Riley, you know, if, if there's one thing about Allie, Allie Riley this year that I, that I could look for is that she can really get better on some of her crosses, and there you go. She gets a cross right there and Becky Edwards on the end of it. Her third goal of the season, wearing number 14, Riley. Scott didn't close down at all, had to respect the speed. And how about Edwards to go take that ball and just put it, you're not going to get to that. And it's it's tough for Hemmings and Mueller and Cox sitting in the back because they're, they're trying to be aware of Martin and Sinclair and then all of a sudden Becky Edwards comes out of the midfield. And really it's the responsibility of Winters and Osborne who were two excellent players who really didn't track back on Becky Edwards. They got to watch that. Particularly, they're, they're playing a two-holding midfield. And they're now looking to score two goals on a 